Honor Club, where honor is real. tournament and uh, his trainer Bob Evans agrees with him the prodigy Mike Bennett set for first round competition yeah, but he has to prove himself he has to prove he's a cut above everybody else He's a guy I think it's going to come out on top in this tournament. He's your choice, huh? He is indeed. Adam Cole and Kyle O'Reilly have made a very impressive tag team duo here on HDNet. Let's see how Adam Cole fares single style against a man larger than him in stature. I, I just think Mike Bennett is way too overconfident about this tournament. You, see, you even see right there the arrogance that he's shown. Nothing wrong with a confident individual inside the ring. Sometimes it gives you that extra edge. If mentally nothing is holding you back whatsoever, if you feel you are the best, you will achieve your goals. Grinding away on the side headlock on Adam Cole. See, Cole tried to pick up the pace right there and shoot him off the ropes, but then it put on the brakes. Never denied the strength of Mike Bennett, just his overconfidence that I think is going to jump up and get him. And there you see Steve Carino watching at ringside. Taking a look at these young athletes, looking to prove themselves as the future of Ring of Honor as part of the top prospect tournament. This, this is a Steve Carino that I, I'm not sure I'm seeing. I, such a drastic change for him, but I'm, I'm open. I'm willing to see if the change is for real. You know, over the past several weeks, Steve Carino has told many of the wrestlers in the locker room and ROH management that he realized that he made a lot of bad decisions in his career and uh, led people down the wrong path. But he's looking to make amends and prove that he can help the young guys in the locker room and be a benefit to Ring of Honor as a veteran influence in the locker room. Did you hear Bennett yelling at? And a goal. I'm the prodigy. I'm the prodigy. Ooh. <laughs> Cole's got an answer for it. Look at Cole. How dare he mock the prodigy? Got some strong chops going at him. He's in the corner after he needs to get in. Out to the floor, looking to set the pace. What's of the that match. all about? What is that all about? Trying to dictate the pace himself. He got out of the ring to talk some strategy with Bob Evans. Got out of the ring because he was worried about Adam Cole. Now we'll see what kind of move Cole's got. He's going to come over the rope. Adam Cole going after Mike Bennett. Hurricanrana. And he's got Bennett in some trouble. Got to bring Mike Bennett back inside the ring and go for a cover if he wants to pull out the victory here. Cole does have a lot of great high-flying offense in his repertoire. And a heck of a chop to the chest there. But you're right, Dave. He's got to get him back inside the ring. Breaks the referee's count by rolling under the bottom rope. 
First 20 seconds on the floor here in Ring of Honor. See the manager there, brutal Bob Evans. Oh, he got a foot right into him. Up against the guardrail. It's the leg strength of the prodigy right there. Just sent him crashing into the barricade. And just that quickly, the tide turns into the favor of Mike Bennett. Got him up, slammed him down on that hard mat. Hey, if Adam Cole wants to do Rana's to the floor, Mike Bennett will slam you on that very same floor and do damage to your back. Into the ring they go now. Here's a cover from Bennett, one, two. Smart move on his part. As soon as the action was back inside, he went for the win. Remember, this is the top prospect tournament. One of these two will move on to the next round. They'll face the winner of Grizzly Redwood and Andy Right Leg Ridge. Right across the throat of Adam Cole. He relies on that quickness. And you can see Cole here trying to get some air into his lungs. Struggling to get that air into his lungs. And he's getting shouted at by Bob Evans. Not sure that that does anything, but. It's intimidation. Mike Bennett now has gained the advantage in the match. Right in the center of the ring, knee in the back, pulling back on the arms. Trying to wear down Adam Cole. Todd Sinclair asking if he wants to submit. Cole says no. Remember the punishment he took outside of the ring. Oh, slammed down onto the hard floor. Now thrown into that turnbuckle. More damage done to his back right there by the prodigy. Cover and a count of two. Listen to Bennett. Boy, he talks a lot. He backs up those words, though. I'm not sure. DDT right there. Out of nowhere. Yeah, where'd that come from? Was planted him head first in the middle of the ring. Both men struggling to get back up. Todd Sinclair has got the camp going. from Bob Evans at ringside for his man. Oh, look at the boot come up from Cole. He's going to fly into him. Cover here. Cole almost advanced on in this tournament. It's going to take a lot more than that to put away the prodigy tonight. Cole's got to really bring the fight. Went up to the second row. Here he comes, right into the arms of Bennett. Oh, Mike Bennett showing a little strength. Blocks the O'Connor roll. Goal slides outside the ring, and there he's got a kick right into Bennett. Right in front of Carino there. Yeah, nice by Adam Cole, who's going up top, high on the ropes. Flies right into him to cover. Only two, he got the shoulder up. Before the referee could count three. Adam Cole thought he had this one. He's exhausted. Trying to use that high flying offense that he's been successful with in tag team action in the past. Holding onto the ropes to block that suplex. We got that boot right to the head. He's in charge right now. Got the roll up one, two. Cole has come awfully close to winning this match. Well, Bennett keeps kicking out, though. He's a tough individual. He's determined to win this tournament and become champion in his first year in Ring of Honor. Brutal Bob doesn't like it. That's obvious. Cole with another shot. Bennett is stunned. Somehow is something left right here. Slams him down to the mat. Here's a cover. One, two, three. Mike Bennett has won it. Here is the winner of the Punisher, Mike Bennett. He had a battle, that's for sure. A strong fight from.
from Adam Cole during the course of that contest, but the prodigy backs up his words. He has every right to be confident, getting his hand raised and advancing to round two. Joining me right now, Steve Carino. Steve, we've just seen the prodigy victorious. The man, great shape, winner in every way, but is there any criticisms that you could think of? Well, I can think of one criticism. A brutal Bob, I'm surprised you haven't told him. Mike, from experience, overconfidence could cost you matches. Overconfidence could be your worst enemy. You're awesome. But man, don't get too overconfident, because anybody can beat you. This is Ring of Honor, man. Anybody could beat you. Steve, Steve, Steve. You just sit down in that chair and let the wrestling to the real athletes. There's that overconfidence right there. Just what Steve Carino's talking about. 